What's up my veggies? My name is VTR and welcome back to the episode review and today we're going to be reviewing um, Going Off of Disney Plus, this is episode 10, um, The Ghost and Molly McGee, uh, season 1, episode 11, The Festival of Light slash Saving Christmas. It's definitely two episodes but I'm not going to get into all that. I, I did a whole video trying to actually, I tried to do this second time trying to record this video and trying to explain all that. I'm not going to, I'll let me read the synopsis of technically both the episodes but whatever. I've got to review it as one. Through the eight, then I'm not even gonna to try to say that. Uh, Libby and her mom spread Hanukkah spirit throughout a townwide blackout. And then the second episode synopsis: um, Molly uses a Christmas carol to convince Andrea's father to save Christmas. Now, I guess before I get into some of these episodes, I should probably talk about what I think about the ghost Molly, the ghost of Molly McGee in general. This is probably one of the best shows to come out of uh, Disney recently. Um, I really haven't kept up with a lot of the shows, except for a sense like Star vs. the Forces of Evil ended. Um, and this is the only one that I've been keeping up with. I've seen a little bit of some of the other ones, this is one I've been and I really enjoy this one. Um, so, that being said, let's talk about both of these episodes. Um, technically one episode, but yeah. <laughs> it's over, it's complicated, it's... Um, Festival of Lights is the first part, I'm, I guess, uh, which uh, deals with Hanukkah. I think, actually, we did do a Hanukkah episode review um, uh, for the Even Stevens. It was an Even Stevens uh, episode review. It was a Hanukkah episode. Um, and getting to see some stuff in here about Hanukkah is really... It's always interesting to see different uh, holiday specials. Um, uh, except if that holiday special is called Eight Crazy Nights. <laughs> that movie's garbage. Um, anyway, but I think, like, the, um, Scratch's song in this one is, like, it's all about how he loves fried food, and, um, just the all around atmosphere of this episode is definitely, there's a bunch of things happening, and just them trying to, like, just them celebrating Hanukkah, and it's definitely just a simple... Uh, story, um, it's it's fun, and I think there's not anything to hate on the episodes. Scratch eats a lot in the show normally, but he eats a lot more in this episode than I think he does in some other episodes. Like he eats a lot in this episode. Um, but I'd mostly uh, blame Libby on that one because he brought up the fried food. Uh, she brought up the fried food. Um, um, next up, um was the second episode that's uh, saving uh, Christmas, which basically there's a festival and it, and it can't happen, so he goes to uh, Andrea's father uh, to like fund it, and he's like, no. So they try to stage a Christmas carol type thing with Scratch to try to make him change his mind. It doesn't work at first, then like, he sees how bad it's hurting Andrea, so he's like, oh, I'm gonna do it for her and everyone, but it's mostly because of Andrea. Um, and there's some good jokes in this second half of the episode, and it definitely the song is a, there's a lot. It definitely has that. There's a song. Every episode has a song, and the song in this one has the very very Christmassy vibe, and it's definitely like a lot of fun to uh, watch this episode, and, and I think there's a lot going for this episode. Um, it's just it's it's overall just a fun time, I'd say. Uh, with this episode, um, I do like the Christmas Carol stuff because I always like like seeing different interpretations of a Christmas Carol. It's always interesting, and maybe I'll review some Christmas Carol stuff uh, later this month. Um, but this is definitely something that has been like one thing that I really enjoy. Uh, sorry, I got my camera on this big monitor over here, and it's like it's distracting me. <laughs> um, but like it is uh, a really fun episode, and I think it's definitely one that I might try to watch every year. Um, overall, both parts, I'm just going to rate it as one episode. Overall, I like the second part a little more because like there's a, like a kind of more a plot. The second, first episode, it's still first, the first episode, like the first section or whatever you want to call it, is also good. It's just 
there's not like a plot, and there's not really the stuff that's needed for a show like Ghost of Molly McGee, even though like there is definitely like, I don't know, the, the stuff happens in that episode, I guess, but there's actual plot in this, in this, uh, in the Saving Christmas episode. They're both really good episodes. I haven't seen an episode of the show I haven't liked yet. I've enjoyed it. It's a lot of fun. Um, it's really well animated and just all that. And maybe I'll review the... I reviewed the show a little bit ago uh, back when it first came out and maybe I'll do a whole season wrap-up, a uh, season review of it before uh, the new season starts. Uh, if it hasn't... If it hasn't started yet. I don't know if it has. Um, but that's what i got to say this review, guys. Uh, my overall rating, I guess I'll probably... I'd give this a solid... Uh, a solid um, three and a half. It's nothing crazy. So I feel like a three and a half is a good solid spot to put this. Um, it's a really good show. Um, um, real quick, I do want to apologize for there not being a um, being a uh, review or anything yesterday. I kind of just completely slipped my mind. Um, and also, wait, merch. Get you some merch, guys. Get you some merch. Just remember, they make great Christmas gifts. Everyone's got to love some merch. But that's all I got to say for this video, guys. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.